Hello. Take the, sorry, what? By hanging out in the garage. What about hanging out in the garage? What do you mean by doing it? Hanging out? Yeah. Um, okay, for the future, help me. What do you mean for the future? Don't do that to me. No. I don't for the future shit. With people. I'm. Like people, you know, um, no, don't tell me what to think or do. Seriously. I don't put up with that. I can't ask questions either. Put the fire extinguisher and crap, you know, so throwing trash around, so we're just booting people out. But yeah, I don't, I don't do the for the future or anything. I don't do requests. May I speak? Before you even get started, I didn't come up very tall, so. Sir, I think you should talk to me. Okay, go ahead and say it since it's so important. I just want to know how to more appropriately be obedient because I've been up here over 10 years and this is the first time anyone's told me I can't be here. As you can see, like, they're playing with fire extinguishers and crap, so I'm just booting people. When people, when they start doing stuff like that, I'm like, everybody get out. Okay. Put it on the media and then other people come up. Are you saying I did that? I don't understand. <laughs> is there a rule to... Is there a curfew? Is there an hour? No, it's, pri it's private property. So when I'm allowed up here during the day, when am I not allowed up here? Are you allowed up here in the day? I'm not here during the day. So I'm not allowed here when you're here? When, when people are acting like this, we got people hanging out in the garage, and I just start booting them out. I don't understand. I hope you don't think I'm not trying to be disrespectful, because I'm trying to be respectful. I appreciate if you're respectful of me, and I think we can just. Yeah, I, I don't know what yeah, that is. The people out of the garage is like people take it the wrong way. Well, maybe they do take it the right way because I mean it's it, you know it's for a lot of people it's just not nice. What's not nice? Get out of here. You know, and a lot of people they just can't deal with it. No, I have no issue. Um, being told I'm not allowed to be here and being told why, I've been but kicked out in my life, you know, other places, and I don't have to it, so it's normal. <sighs> Do me one favor, please tell me why and when I can't be here. We don't want anybody hanging out in our garage. Who's we? Allied Security. Yeah. What time? We don't want anybody hanging out any time. At 3 p.m., you're telling me I can't be here. We don't want people hanging out here. Anytime. Anytime. Now, I'm not trying to be an asshole, but can you like define... Car, someone tried to steal a car yesterday, so they don't really want anybody hanging out in the garages. We don't have a daytime parking service anymore. When we had a daytime parking service, they kicked everybody out. They'd catch kids up here hanging out, and they'd boot them out. You know what I'm saying? No, I don't. I'm trying to, though. We have problems. So we're like, don't hang out. Here. Sounds like you have problems with kids. We do. Are you saying I'm a kid? Well, you've got a helmet on. If I, I, I have to like try and discern, you know what I mean? Like, is that a customer? Is that, I have, that's my, and guess what? I'm not 100%. That doesn't sound like I'm it. Trading stocks. Like I'm not always going to be 100%. And that's life. I'm not asking for one thing. What's the rule? We don't, we don't want people hanging out in the garage, specifically, specifically kids. Because they cause problems like this. Well, I'm sorry for the trouble I was causing. I feel like I should apologize for that. You know, they climb up on top of the walls. They did the burnout there. They did the burnout there. You know, and they'll do it. They'll do it in the daytime while these people have customers. They'll be in here, you know. Can we acknowledge that that has nothing to do with either of us? I, you know, I probably doesn't have anything to do with you. But like I said, you got a helmet on. It's really hard to tell how old you are. But yeah, age really does make a difference. How does it, like if I'm 18, what does it matter? Well, you know, this private property and all it matters is that it matters to me. You or I we? I to make the choice. I actually have the choice of kicking this person out or that person out. I really do. And you're telling me you're gonna keep me from hanging out before nine o'clock because you think I'm too young? Nine o'clock is 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We already covered that. Can I hang out in the 
hang out on the floor below. In the garage, I said. But as soon as I get up here, I'm not allowed to be here any time of the day. That's what you're we telling me. We don't want them because I'm not allowed to or because you don't you're want me to be here. Like just parking. If you're just parking, you know, to go to go to get ice cream or something, then that's a di totally different thing. If people use the parking garage for parking. I really don't want to be a bother, but I really don't understand what's going on. Are you going to call the police on me for hanging out? I'm not going to call the police on you. I don't feel like I have to. I don't feel like you have to either. I just don't understand. I don't understand the contention. I'm not even close to that. We have problems. Kids come in the garage. It's yeah, but house problems. They skateboard. They throw. That has nothing to do with me, unless because kids are coming in here now, you can't be here at this time, regardless of who you are. Is that a rule? Because it seems like I'm being discriminated against for what kids are doing. Regardless, I have to make a judgment call. <laughs> I get to do that. Would it help if I had gray hair? Yeah, it would. It absolutely would. We have never had a gray-haired person do anything in this garage except one thing. I've only seen him do one thing. So what would it matter if his hair was gray if they already did something? I don't understand this. So, All right. I had one the other night I told him to leave. I'm going to start over. I don't mean to be disrespectful, and you're being very patient with me. I'm going to stand here for like two more minutes. Okay. And then I'm gonna leave. Two more minutes. Thank you. It's very gracious of you. When I when I when I see the bike and I see you and this is where kids hang out, I'm like, oh my god, it's another kid. Well, pretty sure I wouldn't be a kid and driving that. That would be illegal. And it was it was uh, actually two guys, two young guys that came up here and did that on motorcycles. So I'm, I'm I saw you come up here. I'm like, oh, no, not enough. Because it was two guys on motorcycle. Well, I'm sorry to disappoint you because apparently I'm not who you're no, looking I for. I don't know who they are. You know, they take off. And, but I'm, you know, I'm just trying to do my job. <laughs> and it's not easy. I get people arguing with me and all kinds of stuff. So. I'm not trying to argue. I'm just trying to understand. And I, f I failed to understand, so I'm sorry. But I'm going to stand here for a couple more minutes. They can't. And, and you know. I don't know why they can't, you know, like, you know, kids I've seen drive up here and just whip it out and urinate on the wall. That's All right. One, that's one reason right there. It's multiple. There's so many reasons. And usually, like, you're getting more information because you seem like you might be, I don't know, you might be 30 or something, but you don't, you're not a teenager, but you're. You don't know that. You don't know anything about me. I don't know anything about you. Well, there you go. So why would you... Never mind. Sorry. I want to go back there. Let's... I'm sorry. Let's start over. You've always been this way. But, um, you know, I, I just can't explain it to some people. They just can't get it. But, you know, we have problems, man. If we had problems, they never would have called a security company to have me come around and kick people out. They never would have. Because there was a time they didn't. It's like it was a bad, it was a bad thing. <laughs> Lots of problems. So yeah, but you know, and then they do stuff, and then it hits the internet, and you get you get like copycats, you know. So if if I've given you any reasons, if you remember it, please don't put it on the internet. It'll literally get all the toxic people. Out. Yeah, we wouldn't want that. And I, I don't know that. <laughs> you didn't sound convincing. No, I'm trying to be polite. So, well, you know, that's fine, but I mean, most people aren't polite. You know, when they're arguing or debating. Let's do this. I'll treat you like an adult. You treat me like an adult. We'll shake hands and part ways. All right. But. Yeah, you know, I, I mean, you just, you know, I don't know. I just what? You just, you just like, uh, I don't know. You didn't, you didn't like. Um, what didn't I do? I, I don't understand. You're trying to present a case, but you didn't. I don't think you did it. Well. <sighs> I 
I don't suppose there's anything to be done. We shook on it. I said I was standing here for two more minutes and there's been no contention. I'm not worried about you now. I mean, I've talked to you. Sometimes I talk to people and you know what? I'm not worried about it. Well, I don't want to tell you how to do your job. <laughs>